just teaching my uh, daughter guitar, and you know, you put two Beatle geeks in a room, and eventually they're going to start talking about the Beatles. And one day we just started, you know, geeking out on all things must pass, and I told him the story about my mom and stuff, and just said, wouldn't it be neat to do a cancer benefit show and just get a gang of folks together and just play it all the way through? I think it was the 40th anniversary is how we started that conversation, but you know, when finally we thought, you know, let's let's do this, let's actually go about it and, and make it happen. Um, you know, I think the next day, or maybe even that night, I just, you know, started typing emails to people that I, I knew were big Beatle fans. I got an email from Jeff in October about a George Harrison tribute project, and my initial reaction was, uh, well, that sounds cool. So then it went from a neat idea to something that we should really think about. And then we went to Frank, Jeff went to Frank and said, at the cradle, and said, you know, we got this idea, and he was all about it. And I think it was Frank's enthusiasm about it, you know, that took it from this would be neat to do to this is something we really ought to do. There were, you know, several meanings behind the whole event. The fact that it was um, a benefit for a cancer financial relief fund. Uh, that's where all the money was going to. And a lot of people from the very beginning when Toby and the people from the Care and Community Foundation gave speeches, I think it sort of set a mood for this is a community. Um, these people are contributing their time and their talents this is something we love, this music. The genesis of the concert, of course, was honoring, honoring the music, honoring those whom we've lost to cancer, um, and an opportunity to come together and do something that had never been done in this area. Maybe with one or two exceptions, I haven't heard of a tribute to this album. And it was such a meaningful album to George, to the people who bought it all through the years, the people who have only recently discovered it. The fact that we played this album um, with a bunch of friends in front of a lot of people 
and it was a memorial to George. It was a memorial to the people who we had listed in the the, the program. Uh, it, it just had a lot of meaning in about three or four different ways. Mm -hmm.